Well, I've been a collector for many, many years now. I guess it's 50 plus years. And uh, sometime in the 1980s, I started writing for the numismatist, uh, wrote a few feature articles, and then Barbara Gregory recruited me as a columnist. I've been doing that for 30 years now. And uh, that was part of the profile that actually got me into the numismatic business. Like a lot of people, I discovered coins when I was really young. I was seven years old when my grandparents gave me some coins. I was curious about them. My dad took me to a local coin shop and I started going to the Michigan State Numismatic Society shows. I really kind of got into it. There were a lot of wonderful people at the Michigan State Numismatic Society, MSNS, who helped me out, Florence Shook. I can name a ton of people and they got me introduced to the ANA and I came to my first summer seminar back in 1993 on a scholarship for an essay I wrote about National Coin Week. It's extremely important for the next generation to get involved with the hobby because we need more kids involved. I mean, we carry the hobby so that when we're 60 years old, there's you know, still coin collecting and that everybody can be involved with it and experience the great experience that I've had. I first came here as a student and uh, now I'm an instructor and have been for the last six years or so. And this is the place that I came to learn how to grade coins. Uh, I learned how to photograph coins here and frankly I learned a lot about how I think about coins in various classes here. And it's been a real pleasure and an honor for me to be able to come back and share that knowledge with the new generation of numismatists. There's books out there and all sorts of different resources, but when you can talk to the people who wrote the books and develop that relationship with those people, it just kind of makes it click on a more fundamental level and you just kind of get more engaged than you would if you're just reading pages, words on a page. The connections that people make here, I've made what I can tell are going to be lifelong friends, um, but also people who I'm able to work with actually in the, in the business world as well. So that's been hugely valuable for me. It is a huge confidence builder for young people to attend summer seminar and I can't imagine friendlier, nicer people getting together in one place really anywhere in the world. It's a unique experience and once you try it one time, you will want to keep coming back time and time again. You know, I would have to say that um, going to the local coin club and getting introduced to a local coin club, which was an ANA uh, sponsored club, um, through the Boy Scouts of America uh, was uh, a, yeah, it was definitely the uh, defining moment in my, uh, in my coin life. Mismatists come from all sorts of varied backgrounds. Um, and so, especially for, for young kids who are coming into the hobby that maybe they don't have a parent who's, who is also in the hobby. Maybe they're just discovering this on their own. Um, this is a way for the organization to support those sort of outliers, those, those kids that are sprinkled around the globe and help bring them together. I know when I, was, when I was young and I was a collecting and then I was also interested in the art aspect, the first summer I came out to summer seminar, I was like, wait a second, I'm not the only one. Like, I'm not alone in this, that there are other kids like me, and we're all a little weird in our own way, and that's okay. And we were the, the relationships with the adults in the hobby, fostering that, passing on the knowledge, um, I just think it's, it's vital for the, for the survival and success of the organization that we continue to bring in the youngsters, continue to bring in um, you know, young kids who have that energy and that drive and that desire to learn um, because that just feed, they just feed off each other. Those who have the knowledge and the passion and then, and then you know, bringing those kids in. I think it's, it's very important. Every donation to the American Numismatic Association enables someone of the next generation, someone who is just beginning to find their love of numismatics to come here, uh, create new friendships, uh, develop resources to pursue the love of the hobby, uh, and perhaps uh, pursue it uh, throughout their life. I can barely remember a time when I wasn't a numismatist, and I can barely remember a time when the ANA wasn't of vital importance to me. It's emotional for me to ask for help for the next kids. Because of what this week, every year, has meant to me.